um, you've just spoken up in support of citizens' advice. Why? Mm -hmm. uh, I think citizens' advice provide uh, a real safety net here in Cornwall. They, they are dealing with an increased workload of people who um, are asking the state for help, um, people who are often homeless or, or threat, of, threat of being made homeless. Uh, and so we need to support that safety net as, as much and as, uh, as, as well as we can. But the Cabinet has taken a view that they've known for several years that uh, their grant was coming to an end. It was going to be zero, and the Cabinet's view is they've been quite generous by cutting them by right. only 53% rather than by 100%. The, 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 clearly, my, my personal view is that we need to give the CAB the tools to continue to help themselves. I think we need to explore all avenues of how we can help them using our resources so we can reduce outgoings, their outgoings such as rent and, 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 and aspects like that so that they can continue to support the most vulnerable people in Cornwall. Um, with, with the new regime such as uh, you know, universal credit. So you think the Cabinet might have to think again on this one? Well, we certainly requested the Cabinet sort, source the funding to give them some relief in the next 12 months to enable to look at their operations and, and to see how they may come to work within the budgets that's proposed uh, 12 months hence.